I don't know what's going on with that shit. All right, y'all. Um, I want to get the fuck out of here. All right, that's a signing ass press, boy. I don't want no smoke, Mr. Wesley. You good. <clears throat> you good, brother. I don't want no smoke. You got it. Oh, okay. You brought me on? <clears throat> you been on. Was this a press? Okay. Was this a press, bro? This right here was somebody pressed me? I said no one to press you. No, because uh, it sounds like it. Someone got the one. What was the warning? You had three days to apologize. So I was going to fuck your shit up, Cali. Oh. And the video that you was reviewing said that in it. You didn't watch that video? Uh, I don't even know which video you talking about, brother. Okay, so what you need to address with me, King? I'm sitting here watching this shit, and again, I gotta see you on here talking shit. No, uh, a while ago we said we was good, right? We, I was until this shit came in my inbox, nigga. Like, until what? Somebody sent you a fucking, t bro, bro. You don't be this mad is you. you in. Hey, bro, this is you right here. This is you talking, bro. You like, got you, damn right. You, you sent that shit. Do I still what? need to fuck your shit up? What happened? You pressed me, nigga. How did it happen? You pressed me. Hell yeah, I pressed you. Who you pressed me? Well, right, I didn't. You know I did. Hi. Oh, okay, I didn't. You did. Why'd you apologize? Yeah. Try me, nigga. Try me. You did. You did, sir. You did. You did. Callie, you I'm did. done with this, bro. All right. Can we be okay. done? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No more, man. Let's just end it. Let's end it, brother. I don't want this no smoke. This sucks. This sucks to continue putting this out here for these people. Okay, so please get off live and delete the video. I'm done. All right, brother. People gonna send people gonna send you more comments to try to fuel you and keep this going. Don't yeah, let them. The, the only problem, though, bro, is you commenting like you like you did some bullshit. I meant to that me comment. Oh, uh, okay, all right. That's that's fine. No, I, I don't. I got you. I got you, brother. You know what you did two years ago, right? I don't. Two years ago? No, nah, I don't. But we good, bro. You said let it go. I don't want no smoke with you, bro. You got it. I got the video. Let's let's both move on. All right, brother. People going, listen, people coming to me too, trying to keep this shit going. I'm not going to. They coming to me. Why don't you show the shit anyway? Why don't you? Bro, I'm not doing it. Listen, listen. listen. I'm not I'm, going to continue. I'm asking I'm you good. to do the same, okay? We good? We good, Kev? If you say so. Only I'm good. So. Bro, I'm good. I've been trying. I, I I did everything I felt I could to get you and we're, to, and, to, to and be we're, better, and bro. We are good, and we are good. We good? All right, bro. We good. I just, okay, all right. That's what's up, bro. All right. Don't listen to them, man. They're just trying to keep you keep you angry. It's all good, bro. We, I'm we, good. We I'm, I'm totally good, bro. I'm totally good. All right. I'm all right, good. bro. Yeah, yeah. So, um, I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm good. Um, hey, man, listen. Y'all have a great day, man. Y'all have a great day. I'm good. I just needed to answer. That's all. I just needed an answer. I don't. I just didn't like feeling like somebody did some shit to me, and I didn't even know what happened. But hey, we good, man. It's a Saturday. I mean, it's Sunday, man. Y'all enjoy y'all y'all Easter, man. Don't be uh out here uh like these uh church gone wild, motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Y'all be good, man. <laughs> mm mm mm. Well, that's certainly different energy from last night. What's up, Chatters? Seemed very pressed and apologetic to me. I don't know about y'all, but it's given ecstasy. I'm sorry. It is 100% given ecstasy. That is not marijuana. So in, in case you didn't know, this person that identifies himself as Chief Cali did an interview in which he goes on with these gay claims from, I don't know, one, two years ago that he's still, you know, harboring. I, I don't know. I can't call it. But if you pay attention to this, this, uh, this interview, he tends to get more animated as it goes on as if, you know, something kicked in. He starts to sweat and he's recanting and he's doing all these stories and he's talking and it's just weird. Like I said, it's just giving this to someone not of clear sound mind and sound judgment you know I, I don't know this person I don't know what they're involved in I don't know what they do but if this is the represent, representation of someone that's helping the community it seems like this particular party needs some help because that didn't seem like a sound mind right there it seemed very much enhanced with something you know what I'm saying that's the type of behavior in which if someone was working with the community or children, someone would say, wait a minute, is this someone that I want to have around kids? Because what in the heck was that? 
This is literally someone, and you know, and people always see what they want to see and hear what they want to see. But this same story has been going on for quite some time with Kevin Wesley and Dwight Howard and this gentleman. And, and you know, it's been going on for quite some time. But this particular party is, you know, so adamant that someone made a pass at him and Kevin made a pass at him and he's not, you know, intimate and dating. So I always wonder with something like that, you know, if you're pressed or, you know, if someone you feel like someone is. Uh, making a pass at you and you're not into it in that way, then why didn't you just completely obliterate this person, knock them out, whatever the case may be, run away, knock them out. Because last time I checked, that's, you know, a lot of guys reaction when, you know, if they feel as if someone is disrespecting them and if they're not into something, um, you know, if they're considered to be a straight male, if someone makes a hard pass at them of the same gender, a lot of times this ends in physical confrontation. So I don't understand why this man feels as if he was put in a situation in which men, you know, put him in a situation in which he felt that, you know, someone was making passes at him and he's totally against it and he didn't want that. And how could this happen? Then why didn't you do anything? You did nothing. You did exactly what you said that everyone else does. You run to social media, you ran to YouTube, you ran to the world. But in that instance, if you felt as if a man was trying to pass at you and you're 100% against it completely, you know, a lot of his posts is gay bashing and things of that nature. So it seems like, you know, for someone to make a pass at him, this is someone that would react a totally different way, possibly striking someone, but he did none of that. This is also a person that talks in the same interview that he was so high during that encounter that he had a conversation with his self, his higher self, his higher said, but his higher self said, who sent you nigga? <laughs> I don't know if he even had a conversation with Scooby-Doo, but you literally state that you were so out of it and out of your mind, you had a conversation in your mind with yourself. These are the things I question when I see these things and more, you know, but everyone, like I said, everyone always draws their own conclusion and think what they want to think, but I pay attention to someone's movements and how they, they operate and things they say in their eyes. It makes no sense makes no sense to me. This behavior makes no sense to me, especially when it seemed like in a one-on-one -on -one conversation, it was completely different energy. I call cap. I call BS. I call, why could you put on one face when you're speaking to the party that you're speaking against? You are, yes, sir. Yes, sir. But then it's a different story. I don't know. Seems like to me, it's just this is someone that might need to just sit down, detox, focus on whatever they need to focus on. You know what I'm saying, sir? <laughs> Get some water. I don't know, ma'am. Later, Chattis.